There is, of course, another music. The whistle of a nighttime train, distant and lonely, as a photo stuck in the pages of a family Bible leaning on the shelves of a second-hand store. A whistle that once sang of freedom, now murmurs death that once emulated the frets of Woody Guthrie's guitar, now mimics white crosses planted in endless rows. But really, it's time we stop romanticizing the rails. If you want to know what a train whistle sounds like, ask the Lakota. Ask the buffalo. 